Hi, this is Jyoti from BIMES. In this tutorial, I will explain you how you can create an uh, empty opening with the floor plan representation as X symbol as well as in the section. And this request will be received from our service team that they want to show an opening in the floor plan with X symbol and also they want to show the opening of the same opening in the elevation with X symbol. And uh, by default, with ARCHICAD openings, you can have just the contour lines on the wall opening but if you see the elevation or section this is how it will look like and now I will explain you how we can create a symbol like this which will show you the X in the elevation and here you can see the X in the floor plan and in order to create this object I saved many objects over here you know tried different methods of saving from 3d view at the normal normally we use the slab as a wall uh, door element and create in the floor plan and save it from 3d view I tried all the options but all the options it was not working with the proper symbol here you can see the symbol it worked well if it is smaller means if it is the exact size as I created and changed from the 2d scripts or using the 2d view in the object settings but this doesn't work if I stretch the object now you can see it goes out and this one I saved it from the floor plan this works fine but we cannot have the symbol in the floor plan if we are using this lab tool again this is saved from the 3d view so if I maximize you can see it's getting bigger and bigger as the size goes so now I got the solution using the morph tool now I am going to explain you how you can use the morph tool to create a symbol or empty opening which will show you the X symbol in the floor plan as well as in the 3d view now in order to explain this here you can see this is what we need to do now here you can see this is the slab the opening which you will see in the elevation and this is the opening symbol which you will see in the floor plan so now I will tell you how you can create this the first thing is that we need a slab so I pick the slab and now I define the zero thickness it's fine but don't forget to mention that it's a wall hole so we need a rectangular opening so I'm creating a rectangular opening with width of 900 and 2100 so this is the first task we created the opening first the next we need to put the cross which we need in the elevation so I'm using the morph and polyline and here if you want to have different colors in the plan as well as in the section then you need to change your color representation so now I'm just picking this property and creating the X symbol now the next task is to see the top view which is this one so how to create this again with the same steps you can use the morph now I'm picking this property now I can go vertically and see distance of 300 and then I can again go and horizontal and finish now it becomes as a plane so you need to select the face and delete the face this can be done by holding the control and shift keys and delete then you will have only the outlines so now we got the symbol which is we need in the floor plan and this is what we need in the elevation I'm going to the floor plan now in general we save the object from the 3d view but in order to get this result you should save it from the floor plan view then only you when you stretch you will see that the object is not getting bigger or smaller it will automatically resize according to the wall thickness and in the floor plan it will be shown clearly so now I select these elements and go to file libraries and object save selection as door I'm going to define the door 
and then save okay empty to run let's see if it accepts yes now here you can see it comes with a pen color which we can modify now this one is the elevation so I can say elevation symbol pen and this one is the floor plan symbol so I can say symbol pen and now these things we don't want so I will show you how we can customize in the scripting so for this that's it okay now the object is saved now let's place the object and see the result now let me delete this and if I choose the door and place the one which I created now I can say it comes with X symbol and the great part is that if I stretch you can see it stretches properly without maximizing anything and if you could see the section view of this or elevation it's very nice over here and now the difference over here is that you can see this I made as a 2D lines so it won't work proper and this one if I make it it is getting bigger so now the next task is if I go to the object settings you will see over here fills, materials, pens you know these are unwanted pens so how we can remove these things so now I'm going to edit the object by opening the object and I'm going to the parameter over here which is parameters and here if you scroll down to the bottom you will see these are the contents now I say I don't want to see this and I don't want to see the fills neither materials and I don't want to see this pen attribute one which I didn't configured and I don't want to see this one and here we can add the preview picture if you want and that's it if I close save now if I go to the object settings you will see only the symbols which you need and now you can see use object spend type is off so it is now taking the properties from these materials that's why you see over here orange now I check this and say ok now you can see the floor plan it's changed and in the elevation you can see it is different and I have uploaded this object to the BIM portal in the BIM components website maybe you can search for this is the object with empty opening with X symbol I hope you can download it from the website thank you very much for watching this tutorial